This is me, and this is me as a vampire. As a vampire, I can't stay out in the sun, and I have to drink blood to survive, and there's tons of vampire hunters that want to take me out. Despite all of this, I want to raise my own vampire civilization and become a vampire lord. My journey to vampire lord starts now on day one. Hey, like the video and sub right now. Do it. Thank you. Anyways, um, this is 100 Days as a Vampire. I'm here. I have this fang. Boom, pop those, and now I'm infected to become a vampire. I'll become a vampire in about one Minecraft day. So this is the only sunlight we're going to be getting right now. So let me just go ahead and grab some wood. All right, and I'll go ahead and make a pickaxe. That is my wood. Okay. Pickaxe. And let's head into this plains biome, I guess. I want to see if I can find a, uh, a village. Because as a vampire, I can take over a village and I can, like, raise my own, like, the like, vampire civilization thingy. Yeah, I, I want to do that. It'd be very cool. I do not think... Oh, we do! We have a village! Hey, 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 yo, 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 oh, oh, hello. And I might be able to take it over once I become a vampire. Oh, it's a tower! Dude, I can, like, live in that. Oh, no. No, the village is owned by hundreds. Hunters? Okay, I shouldn't be here. I should not be here. I will take a bed though. Oh, my, my bad. Can I at least take your hay? Yes, I can. Okay, okay. This is a village controlled by vampire hunters. So once I become a vampire, they will just kill me. Yeah, I'm gonna come back here when I'm a lot stronger so I can actually like take it on and you know, raid it and take it over. I'm gonna kill these sheep so I can make a coffin because I can make a coffin that lets me sleep off the day and make it nighttime. So I guess it's kind of a 100 nights video, but I all right, we're gonna retreat into this swamp biome and look for a safe place to survive. I don't need anything fancy because I plan to take over that village one day anyways, right? All right, any caves around here that I can just live in? How deep does this go? Oh, it ends here, dude. This is perfect. But I'm gonna spend my only day gathering some wood and building a little like cover to make it look like a house when it's actually a vampire den. Yeah, Um, I need stone first. All right, stone ax and stone pickaxe. All right, we also have some coal here. I'll grab that too because I need some torches. All right, the sun is going down. I am in danger. Not a vampire yet, but I have plenty of wood. All right, I'm just gonna quickly build a little shack over here just to like cover up my cave. All right, pillars are in place. We're just gonna build little slabs this way. How did I end up like this? What is this? Is the door off center? It is. Okay, I have a little shack right here. Just got a nice little chill shack and you go inside. It's actually a vampire den. It goes down into this cave. It's very cool, dude. Okay, okay, okay. I do have some iron, so I'm just gonna go ahead and get some uh, cobblestone for that. Let's just break this whole thing down. All right, we have a nice open space back here. And I'm just gonna go ahead and play some chests and a furnace. Uh, let's go ahead and cook our, uh, our iron now for some iron tools. All right, it's still nighttime. Oh, what is that? It was a campfire. Does that mean there's uh, hunters or is it just a random campfire? Well, now it's mine. Oh, I'm also going to make a coffin. I can now make a coffin. And this lets me sleep off the day. So that's pretty cool. Oh, I have a vampirism guidebook. Let me just read this real quick. Main sources of blood are villagers. Well, I'm definitely not messing with the villagers with the when in the hunter village. No shot. I just became a vampire. <laughs> I am a vampire now. Hello, everyone. And the sun's rising right now. So I need to go sleep on to uh, tonight too. All right, we have our iron. Let's go ahead and make some tools. So we're going to make a shovel and a pickaxe and then an axe and then we're going to save the other iron for later. All right. Now what I need to do is I need to get some glass. So I need bottles to put blood in because bottles of blood are basically my food source. So are you chill with me now? Are we we're friends? Yes. Uh, Sure. This will do. All right. I'm going to make another furnace. There we go. There we go. All right. Glass is done. OK, boom. We have bottles, right? But to level up, I need an inspiration altar. So I just need this iron ingot right here. Inspiration altar. We're gonna make a blood container and we're gonna make a altar of inspiration. Boom, all right. There's not enough blood in it. So to put blood in, I need to get blood in these bottles. So I'm gonna grab my coffin so I can sleep off the daytime. And I'm gonna go fill some bottles with blood, I guess. All right. It occurs to me that night times are a lot shorter than days. So, uh, but yeah, I'm not gonna have as much time as I think. Are there any farm animals? What I really need is a village. Oh, you eating that pig? I'll do the same. Yes. Munch. Yum. Hello. All right, we have two full bottles. About to be a third. All right. I'm gonna see if I have enough blood to level up. I only have uh, four bottles, but that should be a decent amount, I think. There's not enough blood in the altar. I need more. Okay. Why don't you have blood? Hello, pig. 
All right, I might have enough blood to get level two. All right, I leveled up. I leveled up. <laughs> Let's go, dude. Now I'm level two and I have a skill point. So I can unlock night vision. All right, what, what's my next skill? What is it? Regeneration? Oh, and then I can turn into a bat? Okay, I need to hit level four. Level four has been turned into a bat. That's amazing. All right, now I'm gonna head out to find a village because they think that's my best bet to get a lot of blood. I'm actually gonna take my altar because I want to be able to fly back home with bat form if I'm able to get it. I also need to remember to keep food because I'm, I'm kind of hungry right now. Hello cows, feed me. Oh, you've been bitten. Someone already ate you. My bad. All right, we have two bottles full already, which I think each have either nine or ten. All right, well, I guess we have to just feast on animals for now until we get a village. There's so many cows around here. This is amazing. Hello, fellow vampire. You just ate that cow. There's a hunter over there. We gotta watch out there, buddy. All right, there's plenty more animals around here, but I really want to test right now. So it's 70 blood for level three. So is seven bottles enough? Seven, is that enough? No, okay, so I need one more. Okay, so it's nine blood per bottle and now, I'm level three. Okay, that means I can unlock the skill regeneration. So I press R and I can press this and it activates regeneration, which I already had because of the leveling up thing, but yeah, it's pretty cool. All right, so if that's the case, to get 100 blood, I would need 12 bottles of blood. I have two already. So let's get 12 bottles of blood real quick and become a bat. Eight, nine, and 11. I need one more bottle of blood. Okay, we have enough blood. Okay, and level four. And we're gonna unlock the bat form. So now I can turn into, I also infect. Oh, I can infect things? Um, am I infecting you? I, I don't know. But for now I can turn into a bat, dude. Wait, what? Bat. <laughs> I'm a bat! Look at me! Now if I remember correctly from this book, um, level four is all this altar will get me to. Now I need an altar of infusion, which is a multi-block structure. I need the altar of infusion, which requires obsidian. So I need diamonds. Okay. Um, we also need pillars, which is just stone bricks. And this is just iron. Okay. So it seems like I will need to go mining soon. All right, because we're level four already. All right, well, first of all, can I make a backpack? I do have some leather. Rabbit hide and iron. Okay, uh, I actually do want a backpack before I go mining, so I'm gonna go hunt down some rabbits. In my epic bat form, yes sir. Oh, pirate ship. Villagers, potentially? I would like some blood. Oh, yo. <laughs> um, okay, well, sorry about this. Not really. Oh, I can hold more blood now. That's interesting. Oh, I also like eat it faster. I'm eating it so fast. <laughs> we just got five bottles of blood. We are good on food for a while. And we got some more leather. And a friend! We have a friend! We have a friend in a bucket. Look at that. We have a salmon. Dude, there's so many, like, buckets of fish in here. I don't really want them, but I'll take them. You know, they're friends. I can put them in, like, a pond, dude. Okay, detour. I'm taking these guys back home. Yes, as my epic bat form. Alright, operation make a home for my friends. Oh, no. Why? 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 Yo, there's loot down there! What did I just stumble into? This is my home. We need to make a home for my friends right now. That's what that's what is very important to me. See, this is epic. We'll just go like this, and then we'll go like this, and then we'll go like this, and this. There we go. That's my friend. All right, now let's explore this little cave, shall we? Oh, this is the ravine next to my house. What are these? Oh, magic. Is this like modern Thomcraft? Aren't these Thomcraft flowers? I don't know how to get spells in that mod. I'm just gonna not get this stuff right now. I don't care. What I do care about is this chest. Hello. Whoa, whoa, this is a vampire hunter's camp. Um, I'm getting good vampire stuff. Dude, I got some good stuff. I got some good stuff. I got some good stuff. I got some amulets. Slightly increase attack speed. Can I just put that on? Oh, I attack faster now, dude. And I also got this. So let's, let's use the summon bat skill outside of bat mode and bats target hostiles. That sounds awesome. Okay, I'm gonna mine all this iron right now. All right, I'm good on iron. I'm pretty content with this. I forgot to put one of my friends in the pond. Oh, I'm sorry, buddy. Right here, little buddy in the pond. Okay, um, let's go ahead and put some of this iron to smelt, because why not? And now let's go back to our original objective of getting rabbits, because I, I do need those. All right, away we go. Let's check out this witch hut. What are they gonna do? I'm a bat. <laughs> oh, I'm sorry. Jeez, jeez, stop, stop. Aha, I knew there was good loot here. Vampire Slayer. I'm good, actually. Are the rabbits here? 
What is that? It's a dinosaur. That's why are there dinosaurs in my vampire world? Leave me alone. Ah! Whoa! Whoa! No! No! Woo. There's no armor when you're a bat. I didn't realize that. I was getting nuked. Ooh, little structure, little dungeon. Hello. Oh, -ho, free anvil. Oh, there's magical stuff here. A mysterious spell. That sounds fun. What does this do? Die. Chain, watery grave, light. I don't understand. A mysterious spell. I found another one. Yo, I don't understand what these spells do. Oh, no. Look at me. Okay, okay. It might be bad, but look how cool it looks. Okay, I'm, I'm, I'm a bat with a blood mood. That's so sick, dude. Um, anyways, that's really dangerous for me. There are many mobs everywhere. Fortunately, most of them are chill with me, but some of them are not. Why would the backpack acquire rabbit flesh? Get the heck away from me, seagulls. No, oh, jeez, that's a crazy cactus, man. No, crazy cactus, man. No. No. No, one of the dinosaurs. No. Stop, stop, stop. Dude, this is so bad. Dude, that blood moon could just move in the, like, oh, there's a village. Yo, it's a vampire village. My people, protect me. Okay, I want to find that vampire representative. Why do y'all sleep in beds? Cringe. Right. That means it's still nighttime. Right. Right. That's like, yeah. I don't. I don't want to be here anymore. Representative, my guy, my guy. Finally, flame proof. Oh, he can give me a, a fire protection seven or, or six. Kill ten hunters and three magma cream. No, I can't do that. I just wanted to see what quest he had. That's not worth it at all. all right, I'm gonna go back to my rabbit hunt now that it's not a blood moon. Oh, there's another village. Oh, rabbit. But you're a baby. Hello, full-grown rabbits. Um, oh, you don't like me because I'm a vampire. This must not be a vampire village. I forgot about that feature. Got him. Cool. Now, is this a hunter village or is it just a neutral village? A neutral would be so much safer for me. Okay, this village does not seem to be owned by a faction. I would see a lot more hunters. That means it's time to feast. Hello, villagers. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> Sorry, sir. Pretty sad village overall. Not very many humans to eat. Oh, hello. <laughs> you're gonna have a fun life, buddy. I will take your blood while you're human, though. I infected this this villager. He's gonna become a, a vampire one day, and the golem's gonna wreck him. All right, we're stocked up. Now let's look for those rabbits. I know I got I, I saw I got some rabbit meat before, but rabbit, you, stop, stop, hide. I need six of this for a backpack, dude. <laughs> My bad. Ow! What? Oh, that flower's crazy. What the heck is this thing called? A yucca flower. Darn right, yucca. I just got knocked away. Dude, is the sun rising again? Yo, where are my rabbits? Some more emeralds, some more iron. Not what I need, though. It's not what I need. Yo, what is this house? Any good stuff? Yeah, I don't understand this mod. If I did, it might be cooler. I got the book. Wait, hold the book in your hands, you feel compelled to open it? You skim through your pages before you know it? Yo, I, I just became a magical person. Can I use this? Mana cost 60. Self cauterize. Wait. Ah, I. Okay, so I can use spells that I find now. That's pretty cool. Too bad I got rid of the ones that I got before. It's daytime. I'm in danger. Why did my sleeping not work? Where's my coffin? Okay, this is really bad. I don't know where my coffin is. And it's daytime, even though I thought I slept. Okay, I think I'm still too weak as a vampire to take damage in the sun. Can I make an umbrella, dude? Oh God, carpet and iron. I don't have carpet. Is there carpet in here? Dude, where's my coffin? Go, 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 go. It's in the tower, isn't it? No, I was never in there. I don't know what the, why I would think that. No, I'm dying. Ah. So I'm in a bad spot. Okay, I am going to sit perfectly still right here until it's nighttime because I genuinely don't know where my any I, I'm confused. Okay, I swear on everything that I slept that it was night 10. I swear I had my coffin in my inventory and apparently all of that was wrong. Wait, I guess it's already becoming nighttime. My coffin's in my inventory. Am I crazy? Was it here the whole time? I thought that was a book. Dude, I'm an, I am I don't know what just happened. Anyways, it's now night 10. <laughs> I still want to do a little bit of looking for rabbits, but I might just give up, to be honest. I really need food. Yo, where are the animals? I'm in a desert. What am I talking about? There's no animals. I need to get out of this desert. Okay, what are the odds there's anything in this to help me? I'm going to go in. Catalyzing gland increases armor? Sure. Do I just, did I just delete? <laughs> Destroys the equipped item. Dude, I'm going to. Okay. Dark blood projectile damage tier two. 
I don't have that yet, but that's really good. Blood bottle, food, thank you. And another vampire book, which I need to for like something later. And this is three magma cream, nice. Okay, okay, I need to go back towards my house. That's what I need right now. There's a village, yo. Why are the villagers awake? Don't be vampires, don't be vampires. Yes, I'm eating you. Thank you so much. Oh, why these bottles have to split like that? It's so annoying. Okay, I'm in the sun, I'm gonna die. Woo, woo. Sleep, 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 sleep. Wait, there's a shipwreck. Wait, I must investigate. If there's a treasure map in here, we could get some really good stuff. Hold on, this is very important to me. Oh, is this like a bad shipwreck? I don't really know the, the different types. There's, there's not a good chest in this one? Oh, lame. Oh, I'm home. Okay, that was an awful experience that I never want to do ever again. I was so stressed out. My fish are still here at least. Hello, friends. Okay, anyways, 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 all that out of the way. I need to go mining. We did not get anywhere near enough rabbit hide. I actually don't even know where the one that I got was. So it, 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 I, I don't, where's the rabbit hide? No, I had one. I swear I had one, dude, I swear. Oh, look at all my iron. All right, we're gonna make some iron pickaxes. We're gonna go mining. Yo, I changed my skin. Look at me, I'm all vampire and stuff. I may have a like, paler skin. Anyways, I'm gonna go mining now. Uh, it's been like a whole day, so I don't remember my objective. I wanna get some diamonds. Yeah, I wanna get some diamonds for some obsidian. So I'm gonna go mining now. What? Oh my god, that scared me so bad. Oh my gosh. Oh, 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 what is this? Aqua Dashers? Yo, I can walk on water? Oh, shoot. I'm running on water. That's so good because vampires are weak to water. That was terrifying to get, though. I wonder if that. No, I'm not gonna test lava, but I wonder if it counts. Nah, I got you. I killed another one. Charm of Sinking can move freely in water. Dude, I'm getting so stacked for things that I'm weak to. I can move freely in water and run on top of it if I want to. Okay, focus on mining. I need diamonds right now. Focus. What? What? Why? 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 Dude, what? Oh, dude, I don't have that much blood on me, though. Come on, man. Yo, stop. Oh, that's so terrifying, dude. Got it. There's some weird stuff in this mod pack, dude. Protects you angelic feather? I mean, eh. Well, I have an angelic feather now that protects me from falls. That's interesting. Why do I have jump boost? This thing gives me jump boost too? Oh, that drains my hunger so much. Nah, I gotta abandon it. I'm sorry, angelic feather, but that is not a good downside for me. I, I do not get enough food. Yo, my boy, the nightmarish crab led me to diamonds. <laughs> I knew it was worth coming over to you, my guy. Let's go. Appreciate that. Yeah. First diamonds, I got two. Oh, I, okay, now it looks like I'm cheating. I found more. And now I can make a diamond pickaxe. Boom, diamond pick, okay. I also have some iron from a chest earlier so I can make a bucket and now I can grab this and I can get my obsidian. Let's go, dude. Okay, I'm just gonna grab like 10 or so obsidian. I'm just gonna gather, gather a, a, a bit. All right, I got my obsidian. I'm still gonna look for a few more diamonds because I do want to be able to get a diamond sword and enchant it. So I'm just gonna look around for a little bit. Yeah, I give up on diamonds right now. I have another sword that I can make that's okay. I'm just gonna go back up to the surface and go home now. <laughs> whoa, 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 okay. Bad place to come up, Jesus, dude. Where's my house? All right, I'm gonna block off this for now because I don't want to go back down there right now. Now, let's cook some stuff, some uh, some iron ore. Now, I do have a weapon that I can make right now and I'm probably just gonna go ahead and make it. Okay, I need an ink sack to make the weapon that I want. Actually, I probably don't want that. Okay, I'll just make this one. I was gonna make a, a katana, but this one is just, just better in every way. So let's go ahead and do it. Let's go ahead and get our coal, surround it in some iron. Boom, long sword. And now we have a good sword. All right, let's see how much durability it has because that will be very good to, good to know because it's low durability, it's a problem. Hello, good sir. Okay, the durability is 512. That's okay, I will admit. That could be better, but it's good enough, to be honest. I can make multiple. I, I can literally make two right now. I can make another one right here. Now I have two long swords, okay? Now what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna make a enchantment table. Let's make an enchantment table. Let's pop that down right here, get some level one enchantments going. Uh, sharpness one, sure. Sharpness one, sure. Um, right now I really need to get some blood before I work on leveling up again because I am very low on that. So I guess I'll go do that right now. Dude, I want to find a village so badly. I would get so much for that. All right, these sheep will do for now. 
I can't do that village. That's that's a hunter controlled village. And also, I kind of want to make it mine one day. So I don't want to kill my future civilians. What is that? Dude, there's a structure over here. What is that? I'm gonna get some more blood before I go over there. Oh, is it like a village? Wait, what is that? Oh, why are they fighting? Oh, they, they that was like, oh, that was a, that was a, that was a, they, they traded, bro. They traded. Whoa, there's uh, vampire hunters here. Oh, it's a witch village? That's interesting. I'm just gonna like look around and see if there's anything cool. Maybe bookshelves? Maybe some more magic wands to cast spells with. Okay, this seems like I, completely useless to me, to be honest. Ah, yikes. Yeah, there, there's nothing here for me. I'm good. I'm done. I'm not gonna b b bother anymore. Oh, whoa. Yo, it's a vampire forest. I've heard about this biome. I, I saw it on the wiki, but I don't know anything about it. Oh, there is stuff here. I'm gonna grab these flowers. These vampire- <laughs> Oh, that scared me so badly. That scared me so badly. Oh, there's another witch village. Why can't they just be like, I don't know, a village village? There's more vampire hunters, dude. Going daytime. I need to get back home like right now. Ooh, made it home just in time. What's good, bro? All right, now I need to figure out how to level up further. So let me just check. What? I'm kind of confused. I'm not going to lie. Human hearts, pure blood, and vampire books? Wait, what is this? Oh, I need more stuff than I thought. Oh, no. Okay, here we go. There's an example. Thank you, because I was very, very confused. I need 12 pillars, 4 tips, and the altar. There we go. I, I figured it out. I need stone bricks. I guess I got to cook stone now. I need 4 blocks. All right, four altar tips. The altar itself needs two gold and some obsidians. Let's go ahead and make one of those. There we go. Altar of infusion. Okay. And now I just need these altar pillars and then blocks of iron, gold, or stone bricks to put inside of it. Okay. All right. Let's cook some gold, some iron, and some more stone. Okay. I guess I just wait for this to be done and then I'm going to build my altar and we can work in level five which will be sick. We're going to be super strong. Okay, we have our 12 pillars now. I might have enough ore blocks to finish this without stone bricks, which will be really good. It'll set us up for the future. Oh yeah, we're good. All right, there we go. We have all the materials. Okay, nothing attack me, please. Okay, I'm just going to put it uh, right here. All right, now we need to put this in the middle. Let me go like this. And then we go altar tip, altar tip, right there, and right there, okay. And then we'll just fill, I guess, two with gold for now, and the rest with iron, okay. And then I may, I need five human hearts, and I can level up again. So I guess to get those, I have to hunt, I have to kill vampire hunters? Oh, that's so scary. Oh, okay, there's a camp of them over here. As long as none of them have a name tag, they should be doable? All right, here's the camp. Do any of y'all have name tags? No. Oh, yes, you do. Paul? Oh, they, they won't leave their camp. Okay. I got one. I got one. I got one. Okay. He didn't drop a heart though. Is it like a chance? But they're not giving me human hearts. Is it only the big guy? Uh, garlic. There's no heart though. I need to leave. There is something that I am clearly not understanding here. They did not give me human hearts. Okay. I need to go back and figure out why not. Those were vampire hunters. So why didn't they drop any? Okay. I mean, it, it says the vampire hunters do drop them, but all right, I'm going to try just farming these guys for a little bit and see what I can get. Yeah, get him. Yeah, yeah, mess him up, dude. Oh, I got a heart. I got a, I got one. I have one. I have one. I need five. I need five. Dude, that's amazing. Okay. I have one. I need five more. Or four more. I just got a book, dude. And vampire blood. What? And another heart. Dude, I am literally getting so lucky right now. I think this camp's kind of dying out. Like, they're spawning super rarely. So I'm going to go find a different camp. All right, here we go. There's a new hunter camp. Okay, these camps are not spawning very many things. I'm going to be honest. I do not know why. Oh, hello. Ha ha, fourth heart. We need one more. Yo, it's becoming daytime again. I've only gotten up to four hearts. Any humans want to spawn? I need to go find a new camp. The ones that I know of just aren't spawning things. Hello, hunters. There's another village. Yo, why are you still alive? I got the heart. Okay, I'm done. I have my fifth human heart, dude. Let's go. <laughs> I don't think I need a bunch of blood to level up anymore either. I think I just need the items. All right, here we are. We put these hearts in. Wait, I need a vampire book too. All right, pop the book in there. And there we go. Do it. The ritual is still... Whoa! 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 What's happening? Look at me. And I'm now level five. Yes, dude. Which means 
I have unlocked another skill point. So I can choose either being able to be in the sun for a bit longer, don't care enough about that, but that would lead to an attack speed boost. Uh, I could get summoned bats. That's just like for PVP, like you hide amongst the bats, I'm pretty sure. Don't need those, definitely. This path seems terrible. Actually, this would be really good because I'm really tired of having to get so much blood, but whatever. I think we're going to go with this one, Vampire Rage. This one just seems so much better. All right, let's go. Vampire Rage. And now I can go into this super mode where I get speed, strength, and haste. So now I need this pure blood. How do I get that? Vampire Baron. Spawns rarely in vampire biomes. It occurs in different levels, partially depending on the player level. Drops pure blood, is very strong. So we need to kill a vampire baron next. Okay, in that case, see, I want a looting sword. Let me see what I can do about an enchantment setup real quick. Oh, okay, I have a, I have a, big, I have a good plan. I have, I have plan, I have plan, I have plan. So we use string and wool and leather. Wow, a backpack that does not require rabbit hide. Almost like I should have installed that mod earlier. Cool, large backpack. There we go. Now that we have that, we can store all kinds of blood, which is amazing. Yeah, okay, okay, okay. The plan now, I'm gonna go find a vampire biome. And we're gonna get some of that pure blood stuff so we can uh we can get the vampire sword and level six yeah we're gonna do that okay oh nah okay i can't get blood here those are vampire yeah this is a vampire village okay that actually might be good for me you sell bottles of blood yes dude that's insane one emerald per three full blood bottle what a guy oh dude don't do this to me all right we got another blood moon all right we're gonna fly back to that village right now hello give me all of this yes dude look at this all right i really hate traveling during a blood moon because of those things so i don't know what to do right now all right i'm just gonna travel and see if i can find a vampire forest actually oh it'd be so good to be there during a blood moon so many more things would spawn dude i messed up you know, I guess I can go ahead and fight some hunters too, right? If I see them, I might as well kill them for the hearts that I need. Yeah, we got one. There we go. Not bad. Oh, we're at my rage mode. What's good? Fight me. Oh, clown. Clown. Boom. 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 Dead. Clown. I almost died. Oh, oh, we found one. We found one. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. We found one. Okay. Vampire forest located. We just need to find some vampire barons in here. Hello. Vampire baron level one. Okay. 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 Whoa, 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 you're fighting me immediately. I'm sorry. I like your wings, though. This guy has so much health. Projectiles? Dude, what? Oh, no. The sun. Oh, God. Okay. Oh, the sun, dude. Okay, I'm just gonna go. Oh, he... He had one health left. <laughs> All right, we have our first pure blood, which we can make all kinds of cool stuff with, including armor. Oh, that's insane. There's a level two. Yeah, those are her minions. They're, they're stuck to her. Oh no, dude. Okay. Rage bows off cooldown. Let's go. Dude, she's so strong and fast. Yo. Minion's dead. Just her. She missed. I got her. I got her. Oh my gosh. Dude, these are no joke. I don't need purity two for a while. So I just want to test vampire blood plus purity two. Do I get like two purity ones? No, that was just stupid. Okay. That I'm not fighting a level five. I'm not fighting a level five. You can't make me. Dude, I'm scared of this place. Level two. That was deadly last time. Oh, we're killing him. We're destroying him, dude. He can't even hit me. I predicted. I, I, okay, that was amazing. That was so easy. I'm leaving now. I'm down in the forest. Level one. I'll do it. I got him. I go. Wait, 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 wait. We killed another. Let's go. I'm leaving. So now we have four pure blood. Okay, that's a whole bunch of those guys that I want to kill. Hearts. Heart. It's double. And vampire blood. Sick. All right. So pure blood can be used for a variety of things, like extra armor, which is really good. Okay, for right now, I'm going to use this to level up. We'll do that. We'll do a pure blood one. Leveling up. Okay, there we go. I'm getting juiced up. Oh. And there we go, level six. Now I can level up one more time, get one more skill. I think we're just gonna stay down this tree so I can get more blood. All right, what do I need for my next level up? Okay, so I just need to get 10 more hearts and we can hit level seven. I think I'm gonna make, let's make one of the weapons. I'm gonna go with the sword one. Okay, heart seeker. Now it starts off very weak. I think you have to train it, but look at this sword. It's so sleek, it's so sick. All right, so we gotta get a blood pedestal. All right, blood bottle right there, obsidian, gold, and some wood. Boom, blood pedestal. How does this work? Place on top of any blood container or tank. Oh, all right, well, I can make that pretty easily. 
then we have a container of blood and then we can put the pedestal on top like that and then we can put this in here and then we can put these in here and it charges it there we go dude and it seems to be fully charged do i want to give this sword a name what's a good name for a vampire sword suck blade all right now i need to kill stuff with it to level it up oh wait 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 wait! didn't i get a amulet earlier train vampire swords faster there we go die okay give me a minute okay my sword's charging there we go trained 12 percent Ooh, okay hello hunters oh it's already noticeably faster all right the sun is starting to rise we are at 98 percent trained come on i'll just kill this 99% train. I think it, I think 99% is where it stops. I'm just gonna go back home now. I'm scared. Yeah, okay. It does not go past 99%. That's fine. It seems really weird, but I guess we need the enhanced version. There's an enhanced version right here that requires the better stuff. And that one I imagine will just be a lot better. Let's go ahead and charge up. All right, there we go. Fully charged. 99% trained. All right. Well, we have a pretty good sword now. I do want to get it level 30 enchanted. We have level 29 right now. So I think my next goal is to get books. Because if I can get looting, I can get the human heart so much easier. So yeah, let's head out and get some books. Not that one. Not that one. I can't beat that one. That one might be doable. Ice Castle's dangerous. It does have totems of undying, though, but it is very deadly. Hello. Yo, we're getting XP. And, uh, nothing else, really. Okay. Uh, reach? That sounds overpowered. But there's no bookshelves here. There's gold, though. Yo, I need this for, like, leveling up later. Oh, give me a break. Another one, dude? Come on, now. Oh yeah, let's, let's take this uh, this dungeon map that I can't read because I'm a bat. Okay. <sighs> All right, now where does this map lead me to? Northwest, okay. Seems to be in this mountain somewhere, or in this little hill. Yo, where's my buried dungeon? I was promised a buried dungeon. This is not a dungeon. Golden apple, diamond. Well, that was a waste of my time. You know, there might be something pretty interesting in an igloo. Oh, what the heck are those? Oh, what is this? Frozen core? Snowman drop? What does that give me? Hair leaves from trees with cold? I mean, that's kind of cool. I guess I'll grab these. these. These can make some interesting stuff later if I want to. I probably don't, though. Now, I'm going to keep these this potion and this golden apple. So I might be able to make a villager near my house later. And if I can make, like, a librarian, I might be able to get some good enchantments. I'm just going to leave this guy here, though, because I really don't care about him. Are you kidding me, dude? Why was there an ocean monument under me? Back on my hunt for bookshelves, I guess. Oh, bookshelves, yes! I found some in this witch's house. There was there was three bookshelves. Okay, if all of these houses just have three bookshelves, then we're kind of chilling. They don't. Okay. Oh, a mysterious spell. I can actually use these now. Summon night vision, but it requires 244 mana. Yeah, I'm just gonna start grabbing this stuff. This is not going great. Wait, I can use this one. Felled oak. Felled. Whoa. What does that do? Is it like an attack? Get oaked, nerd. I don't know what this does. Oh, dude! Look at the spell that I just got. I have to use this mod for a video. Let me know if y'all want to see like 100 days as a sorcerer, dude. Emanation slow silence. Dude. Oh, okay, it angers you though. Oh, that's so sick. Oh my gosh. Oh gosh, okay. These towers can be very deadly, but they also have rooms in them with enchantment setups. Uh, I, this is really bad. This is really bad. This is really bad. This is really bad. I was in bad form and my game lagged and I died. This is really bad. I can't get out of this situation unless I get like some health back. If my game didn't lag, I was fine. Those zombies will come after me. There's a silverfish to my left. I don't know if I'm given extra health when I resurrect or not. I think so. Go. What? I'm so good. I'm so good. Oh, I can resurrect again. Oh my god, dude. I, I couldn't turn off my bat mode. I was, I'm stuck in bat mode. Now or never. Regen active. Leave. Leave. It's daytime. No. Okay. New plan. I have to wait here until nighttime because the sun will kill me guaranteed. So at nighttime, I can turn back into a bat and fly away. I can run away. I can take at least like one, two hits maybe. Then I can fly away. But there's vampire hunters to my right. Okay, the sun is going down. Uh, this is pretty sketchy though. There's a lot of dudes with crossbows just staring me down. But as long as they're not vampire hunters, they can't kill me permanently. I'm just gonna res and then run that way. No! 
Okay, so the funny thing is, y'all, this don't count, right? So hear me out, right? Hear me out, right? So I start, so listen, so so basically, so basically what happened was, what well, basically what, what happened was, um, the game glitched. The game glitched, right? The game glitched. Uh, so the, 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 it glitched out, it glitched out, and basically I starved to death even though I didn't want to. It's basically how that goes, right? So it, it doesn't count. It doesn't count. It, um, anyways, give me a, give me a second. Yo, look at all this sick stuff that I just found out. Leave me alone! Also, if anyone's mad about that, I lost my 30 levels, so I don't want to hear it. I spent 30 days getting those, and they're gone now, okay? Okay, so I'm not going back in that tower to make up for my, um, my, as some might call it, illegitimate gameplay. I'm not allowed to take on that tower ever again. Not that I would want to. All right, let's go back to looking for books. Oh, wait, my sword was 100% trained now. Oh, that's cool. I don't know what I killed to do that, but I was, I read that it wasn't supposed to go past 99, but I guess it did. That's pretty cool. Uh, okay. So another downside to my illegitimate gameplay is that I don't have a bed anymore. My coffin is gone. I lost it when I was recovering my stuff. I guess I just didn't grab it. Wait, I forgot about these. Yes. I can go like this, but what? Okay. I mean, yeah. Yeah. I guess the rain works too. I'm going to go look for some sheep right now. I want a colored one this time. Y'all have any colors? Okay. I'm going with a cooler coffin this time. Look, this one is red. Whoa. And now I'm going to sleep. Now it's night 33. Oh, shoot. The sun is going up. Oh, no, 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 no. Danger, danger, danger. Uh, I don't know what to do. 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 Boat, 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 boat. Okay. Sketchy. Hello. Hello. Do you guys happen to be vampires? Given... Oh, wait, you are. Oh, sick. Okay. Faction representative. Hello. Oh, wait, what are you? Oh, oh. Oh, you're a vampire expert. Okay. So if you level this guy up, he'll he'll give you really good stuff. But if this is the job block, has been abandoned. Oh, my bad. But did I just ruin y'all's thing? Can I just take this? Sweet, dude. Okay, so you can only get one vampire expert villager per village, and you just have to hope he has good trades. And I can't make him I don't I don't think the odds of getting a zombie one would work out, to be honest. Alright, we have a really good plan of action then. We really want to get a vampire expert villager all the way leveled up. That's like the big goal, the big dream. What is this? Wait, is this one of the libraries, bro? Oh my, bro, there's a library here. Bro, there's so many bookshelves here. Okay, this is actually really important though. I kind of want to infect these guys because if I can get some zombie villagers going, we can get some really good stuff. Good job. Okay, cool. All right, we have some villagers trapped in there. We're just going to check these enchanted books real quick because why not? There's a full enchantment setup, dude. That is so crazy. All right, come here. Yes. Okay. There you go, sir. Enjoy. All right, they're infected now. Now I just need to separate these two. There we go. Get two golden apples, get my potion of weakness. And there we go. We just got two zombie villagers. All right, I'm gonna wait for these guys to convert. I'm just gonna chill here for a bit. Yeah, I have two lecterns. That's amazing. Okay, we're gonna go for looting three. Oh, there we go. One of them converted. All right, now let's just reset them with the electron until we can get them to sell looting three. Oh, wow. Okay, lifesteal, huh? <laughs> I don't have that many emeralds though. Lifesteal, wow, okay. Actually, I, I do have enough. I do have enough. Okay, we're gonna grab a lifesteal three book. That is so worth it. Now we just need looting. Issue there is I don't have any more, uh, any more emeralds. But there's, I, I'm in a place full of villagers. So tss, give me a Fletcher, give me a Willow Log, make a bunch of sticks. All right, somebody give me sticks for emeralds right now. Don't just stand on it, take the job, lazy. All right, these villagers don't convert. So I think I have to go find a different village, trade with them, and then come back. Hello, vampire village. I'm here to acquire sticks. Oh, there's a bit, oh no, they're under attack. That does a lot of damage, okay. Sir, stop running into me. I got him. Woo -hoo -hoo, save. Why is there not a vampire expert here? That's what I don't understand. How about a Fletcher job? Bet you someone would love a Fletcher job, right? So do villagers not function during the night? Is that a thing? Because these are literally vampires. Like, okay, you became a Fletcher. Awesome, awesome, awesome. Okay. I don't know how that happened. Wait, three? What? He sells human. This guy's amazing. Dude, that's my guy now. Okay, so much is going on, right? Yo, I'm going to infect this horse. Check us out, right? I infected that horse. I'm going to do this one too. Boom. It. Got him. Now they're gonna become vampire horses. It's gonna be so cool. My Fletcher! Yes, my guy. Dude, he just sells nine hearts at a time. I'm buying him. 36 human hearts. My neighbors are gonna think I'm a freak. Okay, I'm gonna look for a gigantic forest of some kind. Cause I have a mod that makes you like, I have the RL Craft tree mod. The one that's in RL Craft where you cut down trees in one swing. This is where I'm gonna get my emeralds and my hearts. And then I'm gonna get the looting from over there, which I guess I don't really need the looting as much anymore. No, yeah, I'm just gonna save that villager over there. I'm good now. I don't need looting anymore. I'm going home right now. Actually, I'm gonna secure my guy first. 
My guy is now secured. I'm going home with my 36 human hearts that I now have. Let's go level up. I, I think we can actually level up right now. I'm pretty sure we can. All right. So we put in the pure blood, the book, and we put in 10 hearts. And there we go. The ritual begins. <laughs> Let's go, dude. And boom, there we go, level seven. Let's go ahead and apply that skill point. I think I definitely want to get this one where I instantly kill anything below 25%. Our next level will get us the projectile. What do I need for the next level? 26 structure points and the same for everything else. I'm going to investigate this hunter village over here and see if I can find a book in there. Nah, they don't have the house that I need. Okay, how do I get vampire books? All right, another blood moon. All right, so right now we need to focus on getting vampire books. They drop from advanced vampires and advanced hunters, but also structures, like just generic loot chests. Okay, I'm going to quickly make some axes. I think I'm going to try and get some emeralds, and I think I might get looting three. I think my best bet is to farm them from vampires and uh, hunters. I'm going to go look for a big forest of some kind, like a redwood or, or something that gets tons and tons of wood. Dude! What? I get that it's a blood moon, but geez, what is this? Okay, I kind of just want to see what happens. I'm just going to click on this. Under attack from vampires. Is that just, does that just happen? Wait, wait, what? <laughs> yo, yo, there's vampires coming to help. <laughs> vampire village raid. So this this should end soon and it'll, it should become a vampire village. He has pitchfork. He has a pitchfork. He's fighting back. He's trying to get me. Oh, no. <laughs> A nearby village has been captured by vampires. So what, all the remaining villagers are vampires now, if there even are any? Or do they just kill everyone? I'm poisoned now, thanks guy. Yo, can I just eat these human hearts, please? That fully fills me, dude. That's definitely a new food source. Oh yeah, this is what I wanted. I wanted a big forest, right? All right, most things here are pretty chill with me. All right, let's, let's, uh, let's get these trees down. It's a, a tons of wood for the, uh, the Fletcher. Don't stand there! That wasn't my fault. All right, I have a decent amount of wood right now. I'm gonna go back to the village near my house. I'm gonna try and get uh, a ton of emeralds and I'm gonna go back to the library with my zombified villager and I'm going to get uh, looting three. I also should get some experience soon so I can get like sharpness. Yeah, slight change of plans. I'm gonna, I'm gonna kill stuff tonight, I think. All right, I think I might just try and get like sharp three with level 20 and call it a day. I don't like grinding XP, it's annoying. Yeah, okay, back home I go. Whoa, is this an igloo? Oh, it's a dirt igloo. I love this mod. It's so convenient. I forgot I even had that installed. Well, now I have a new golden apple and new potion of weakness for whenever I find another uh, zombie villager to convert. Hello, sir. I have lots of wood to convert into sticks for you. Casual nine hearts. Any levels up, up. Hey, y'all are so loud for no reason. Dude, now he's the, he's on discounted prices too. I can get so many hearts, dude. I'm just gonna buy like a bunch. I have a stack of hearts now. All right, now we're gonna go get looting. Hello, place with the angry golem that will kill me. I'm here for trades. Should I try and enchant the sword first? Probably. I didn't really consider that. I should try and, I should try and enchant the sword first. That'd, that'd be smart. Sharp two. I'm actually gonna grab that. Okay. And sharp two. There we go. Now we have sharpness three, guaranteed. This is officially the longest I've ever taken to get the enchantment that I want from a villager. Mending, dude? You gave me mending before looting. You're terrible. He can sell looting, right? Am I crazy? He sold fortune already. He sold literally everything besides looting at this point. I've decided, man. I just don't care. Sir, I'm sorry about this. I know you're my friend, but now you're about to be a real good friend. I want to know if they, if you get infected, do you stay a, 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 a guy? I'm Googling. Can villagers trade looting? Yeah, no, I Googled it. They can sell looting. Apparently. Actually, no. You know what? Give me insight again. Insight seems pretty good, too. I'll take insight. My desire sensor is going off the charts, and now it, it will never give it to me. Insight three. I lied. It's right there. That actually gave me a headache, dude. Are you kidding me? A blood moon? Okay, I am gonna head home. And I'm gonna kill things along the way to get experience. Okay, XP grind time, die. Just enough to get insight on the weapon. Okay, I'm home. I have my sword. I will try and get everything on it. What does insight go on then? Why would this be a helmet enchantment? I can wear a hat. Let's go. Five black wool and one red wool. Get infected, nerd. Oh, dude, I can actually make some armor, I think. Uh, yeah, I can make some more armor, too, but for now, I'm just gonna make this hat. Yeah, no, I, it doesn't give me armor, but it doesn't, like, slow me down. Look, it actually, like, it looks pretty good. I actually kind of like that. And now, I can take this hat, I can put insight on it, and then the sword, and I can get sharpness, too, and critical boost. What is critical boost for? 
It's for sword. Just not my sword, I guess. That's cool. It's literally right there. It's literally right there. Why Why not? Why would you not let me do it? So now, in theory, we can go kill things and uh, get a bunch of experience. If it gets me all the way to seven, it's really good. Wow, it actually did. All right, this hat only has 165 durability. Okay, that's kind of sketchy. What I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna farm stuff for XP and I'm gonna try and get enchanted books that have like looting on it. I, I specifically want looting, but I'll also take unbreaking for my hat because it clearly needs it. Yeah, I'm just gonna farm XP and I will be back whenever I am level 30. Actually, that's kind of dumb, hold on. Okay, it's getting a little cramped in here, so I really want to take over that city soon so I can uh, have a better place to live. But hey, we have an enchantment set up now. <laughs> I promise you I'm going to have a really cool house later on in that city over there. I promise you. But right now, this is what we got. All right, I should reset enchantments to try and get looting. I want to make another one of these swords, though. All right, make some more iron. Make another sword. Let's just try and see if we can find a looting three. All right, that was really fast. Looting three right there. And in the, oh, I can get on a book too. Is it smarter to get it on a book? Probably. I just need to hit level 30. I'm going to go farm XP. Let's go. All right, one more kill. Level 30. There we go. And let's get our looting three enchanted book. Now we're going to go into the anvil. Boom. Looting three sword. There we go. <laughs> okay. Can I get anything cool with, uh, with this unbreaking? I actually kind of want that. Yeah. Oh, didn't I have a lifesteal book? Dude, I forgot all about that. I have a lifesteal. There we go. Lifesteal three. And I just got a leech on this one, which is like lifesteal again. I can get even better in the future. Also, I don't really need this anymore. So I think I will just destroy this and I'll equip this. Now I have a bit higher movement speed and I also can see higher, more in, in vampire forests or whatever. This looks so cool. I like this. This is so interesting. Anyways, uh, I now need to farm for the vampire books and I also need to get more pure blood. So I think I'm going to head to the vampire forest and grind for a bit. Oh, uh, dude, I'm terrified of everything else in the forest, though. Like, there's some sketchy, like, those, like, phantoms can, like, kill you somehow. Those little, like, wisps. Level three Baron. I don't know about that one. There's a level one Baron that'll do this. Dude, this lifesteal is so strong, and it fits a vampire, so it's fine. I'm gonna fight level three. I'm gonna do it. Go. They're healing her. Ah, dude, there's, she's summoning more behind me. I got her. Okay, we got her. We got her. We got her. That was level three. That was actually pretty tough. Are there any advanced vampires here? Oh, they're fighting each other. Yeah, I'm going to join in. Guess you die level two. You're not as low as I thought you'd be. There you go. I'll kill another Baron. I I, I do need more pure blood. I'm going to wait for my, uh, my rage mode to come back. Rage mode! Not a fan of the blindness. All right, there's more pure blood. I don't think advanced vampires are spawning here. It's all like vampire barons, which I don't really want to kill. Like the blood is useful, but I don't need that much. All right, but I spent the entire night uh, farming in that forest and I got no books. I actually didn't see a single advanced vampire. I only saw barons and baroness. And I don't think they can draw what I need. Um, I got a bunch of pure blood though. Yeah, I'm just going to sleep and then we're going to go hunt around the world for advanced hunters and, and vampires. Oh, and there's an advanced hunter. That was fast. Give me what I want. No, but you did give two items. That's that. That shows that looting does work. I need at least I, I need a bunch of books. Actually, I'm level seven. I need seven more books to get all the way to 14. Hello, advanced vampire. No book. You know, I'm actually going to play it smart. OK, so the way you get these books is you get them either in chests or from vampires and hunters like the advanced ones. So I think right now I'm actually going to go explore and try and find like structures like 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 that, that one behind me, but not that one. I'm going to go look for like some desert temples and stuff and try and find them that way. And while hunting those structures, I will also be killing advanced hunters and vampires. You advanced, you're advanced. Hello, no book. Oh, you're both advanced. Oh, that's that gave so many blood bottles. Why are you not dead? Book, book, book. First book. Let's go. Y'all, we got our first book. Let's go. Dude, I look so good. Blood Moon. Sure. Why not? Hello. Are you a vampire? No. Oh, it's a neutral village. Well, not anymore. <laughs> if this becomes a vampire village, I might get uh, a vampire expert to trade with, which is really good for me. Can I find a zombie villager? It's a Blood Moon. If I can find a zombie villager and lead him over here and cure him, that could be really, really strong for me. Yes. Perfect. Come with me, my guy. Come here. I got him. 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 Potion. All right. I'm going to leave that guy in there. Is he a nitwit? No. Oh, he converted. I heard it. Okay. 
We might have a really good vampire expert over there. I don't know. Take the job. Take the job. Is it because he's not a member of this village? Should I give him a bed? I'm going to give him a bed. Oh, he did it. He became a vampire expert. Yes, dude. One heart for pure blood. Seven pure blood. It's only level one, though. It's not that good. We can level him up and get pure blood, too. Come on, man. Restock. He restocked. I saw it. Yes. Give me more pure blood twos. A bunch more ones. He restocked again. Yo, another pure blood two. Let's go, dude. And he's going to level up pure blood three for five. The enhanced ingot, dude. I just got my weapon enchanted dude okay i'm gonna do i'm gonna do it what a legend this guy is am i right so i can enhance my weapon my concern is does it keep my enchantments i can't even do it this is probably for like repairing or something so i have to make a brand new sword dude okay well later we can work on getting a better sword we have the ingots i'm not gonna do it right now because I, I like my current sword and also it's enchanted and stuff but later we can get a brand new sword and i just leveled 30 off the trade so even better all right his coordinates are saved. We are going to uh, continue our hunt for books, but we now have a really good source of purified blood. Oh, a village. Hello. Do you happen to have a vampire hunter trainer? No, you do not. Hello, Paul. Sorry, a vampire evader that looks like Paul. How dare you not be Paul, dude? I like Paul better. Do you get for not being Paul, idiot? Hunter trainer. Yes, you're the house I've always needed, my friend. You attack me? Oh, you do. I'm sorry. Oh, but I can't hurt you. Oh my gosh, I am simply going to loot your chest and uh, and leave. That guy did so much damage. No, no, no. Oh, totems of undying, though. I want the emerald blocks. That's all I want. I know the loot here will not be what I need, uh, so I don't care to loot. I just want the emeralds for the uh, trades later. Wait, I should have grabbed the totems. What am I doing? Right here. I'm going to grab these. Find wounds. <laughs> Bubbles. Oh, hunter trainer. Yes. Uh. I can't really fight him. He'll just kill me, but I can loot his chest. Yes, one more book. Okay, book number two. Compass. Oh, this had a compass in it. It's so useful. Oh, because now I can do this. Yes. All right. And then we can go compass. And now we can look for a plains biome. And this is a higher chance to have good villages. Yes. Oh, here we go again, Mr. Snow Temple. I'll defeat you this time. I know the strats. No. Yes, the water saved it. I get the loot. Book. Yes, that's an advanced hunter with a crossbow. Hello, you're not advanced. Never mind. You suck so bad. You're an advanced hunter, though. Book. Yes. OK, that's two books or that's four books, four books, two from Hunter, a diamond and an amulet that might be very good later. Hello, Mr. Vampire Evader. We meet again. Give me a book. Yes, thank you. I just had to ask five. I need two more. Yo, it's coming together. Well, I can't go in. Th oh, now I'm between a rock and a hard place. Give me, just give me the loot. Book. Let's go. Book number six. We need one more. Oh, yes, 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 bro. We need one more book. I am T-posing. I don't know why. Vampiric glove artifact. I have to. Dude, that vampiric glove is so sick. Dude, I'm going to regen so much health when I get kills now. I'm so good now. I'm so strong. Let's go. Yo. Oh, it's just a mine shaft. Oh, I mean, hey, this chest might have what I need. Oh, <laughs> Dude, it has the it has two books in it. Okay. Yo, wait, 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 wait. <laughs> dude. If I knew mine shafts were so OP. All right. Well, I'm gonna fly home now. As I, I was already kind of doing that. And there's my home. Oh my gosh. I'm so glad to be done with that, bro. That took so long. <laughs> first things first. I want to make a new sword. I want to make a new sword. Boom. Okay, new sword. Now, what enchantments can I get? Sharp three. Yes. All right. So now we can have a sharp four leech three sword, and I can head back to my library and get a uh, life steal. Hello, Mr. Life Steal. Thank you. Okay, I'm back home. Let's hit it with that sharpness four, and let's hit it with that that, that life steal. Okay, so basically, I don't, I don't think I explained what they do because I barely know myself. Life steal will heal me whenever I attack something, and leech will uh, will heal me whenever I kill something. So basically, I get a lot of healing as I do damage, which is very fitting for a vampire IMO. So I'm kind of happy about that. Now we need to fill it with blood. We do have this suck blade. Unfortunately, is going to get retired. All right, I will make a pedestal, and I will put suck blade here. All right, let me grab this. What should I name my sword? Celeste? I've never played that game, so I can't really do that. How about suck blade? All caps, two Cs. I like it. Now this thing attacks like pitifully slow, so we have to train it again, which is a downside, but look how cool it looks, dude. Let's go. Who wants to die? Who wants to give my sword some training experience? I would like to get it to at least like 99% today. Hello, zombie. 
Sorry. 16? This train's way faster. What the heck? Uh, vampire hunters, we got an issue. There's a, there's a little tiny ball of light being attacked by two fully armored dudes. Oh, well, my sword's fully fast now, I'm pretty sure. It certainly feels like it. 70%, let's go. Ooh. Regen amplifier and increases speed. Okay. I, I do use regen quite a bit. Yeah, I'll wear that. It's way better than my current one. All right, we're at 90%. That's pretty good. The sword's usable now. It'll train more on whenever we do other things. Now I want to go home and try and level up. I'm still T-posed. I still don't know why. All right, I do need more gold blocks, I think, but those are really easy to get. There we go. All right, we have some more gold in there. Now let's see what we need to level up to our next level. We're level seven right now. How high can we get with what we have right now? I think we can level up to level nine right now. 10 hearts, one blood, one book. Boom, and there we go. So now I'm level nine, or level eight rather. So now I can do this, this, and this. Boom, that's enough once again. Level nine, all right, all right. Level 10 requires a purity three, 15 hearts, and a book. Well, I do have some purity threes. Structure is wrong, no. I don't have enough gold now, okay. All right, well anyways, let's go ahead and uh, apply our new levels. We have two skill points, dark blood projectile and blood charge. So now I can charge my sword wherever I am, just like this. And then I also have dark blood projectile. I have an attack and not only do I have that attack, I have this ring, which increases the damage to tier two. One, two, three. Okay, so three hits does at least 20 damage. So it's like what? At least seven to eight damage per hit? Alt one, okay. And I could do like alt two to go into my rage mode. That's so cool. Okay, I have keybinds now. I'm a true MMO player. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15. So you need 18 blocks of gold in total. Right now I have uh, seven. All right, so now I need to get 10 more blocks of gold. All right, we're gonna go get our gold now. I'm gonna do that by heading over to the vampire expert that I have trapped over here, because if I can just trade him for some more purity three blood, I think I do need some. I have like, what, one left right now? Yeah, I have one purity three left. Oh, I only need two. Okay, I need purity four then. Well, if I can upgrade him, then that, that still works. It still helps, you know? Oh, I do need more hearts as well before I can even do that. Give. Thank you. Oh, here's a tower with gold on it. That's exactly what we want to see. Okay. Don't mind if I just take this. All right. Here's our village with our guy in it. Oh, and there's a tower here with gold on it. Right. Yeah, I did not remember that, but I do now. Perfect. Okay. Hello, sir. Okay, he just trades a lot of stuff now. All right, purity three blood. We need that. There we go. We leveled him up. All right, so he has purity four and a cloak. I'm not going to get that cloak right now. We need one more purity four. So I just need him to restock once and we're good. You restocked my guy. Okay, I don't think he's going to restock because he did the sparkle, but it didn't restock his stuff and I don't want to wait any longer. So we're going to have to get our purity five blood the hard way. Boom, boom and boom. Then we hit this. And boom, there we go. That's level 10, 33, 15 hearts, and a book. Level 11, 20 hearts, a book, and a single purity four. And we're level 12. Now, to hit level 13 and 14, I need two blood each. I need two purity four and two five. I have one four right now from the trades, but that's all that I have. Um, I have no five at all, so that's unfortunate. Which means I could go back and trade that villager some more, but that's kind of boring, you know, don't you think? It's a little bit boring just to get it all from a villager. So I think I'm going to head to the vampire forest and we're going to fight some high level vampire barons. And I can unlock some skills. First skill I'm going to unlock is freeze. This will freeze stuff in front of me. It's pretty epic. It's pretty cool. Now, what do I want to get next? This middle tree can give me buffs. It can give me permanent attack damage. It can give me attack speed or movement speed. So I'm going to go with this one. We're going to unlock sunscreen, whatever that does. And now we have permanent speed boost or attack speed boost as my choice. I'm going to go with movement speed. Now I need to go and uh, make sure I'm good to go. My sword is juiced up. I believe it is time to go hunt some vampire barons. Oh, right. I got new skills. Sunscreen. So I, I assume I'm allowed to like survive in the sun for like 30 seconds. Okay, that's pretty bad. Now what does freeze do? Is this thing just frozen solid? Okay. All right, here's the vampire forest. Hide behind, okay. Don't wanna be messing with that, but there is a vampire baron level five right there. I'm gonna try and lure him over here. That does a lot, that does like four hearts. That does so much damage, okay. And you're fast. Slow him down and freeze. I. It's on cooldown. Okay, I need to freeze him. I wanna freeze him. I'm, what's the cooldown on this thing? Whatever, I don't need it, I'm a god. 
Bro, I'm not even getting hit. Let's go. All right, that's one of our purity fives. Oh, level five. Okay, it's next to a boar. Level five vampire baron. Why do the level fives not have minions? Oh, I'm wrecking. I'm shredding him. Oh, I comboed him so hard. Why can't I? Oh, I got it. Oh, oh, he was low. Okay, he was trying to run away. All right, well, this is my last purity five. Now I just need a purity four or five that I can downgrade. Level five. There we go. Okay. All right, this one has minions. Oh, she's stuck in the water. <laughs> Idiot. <laughs> Idiot. Oh, you're frozen. Idiot. Got her. Okay, we're out. We have three more level fives. We can downgrade one of them using vampire blood, which I have on me right here. So we can go like this, like this, boom, purity four. And now we can head home and hit level 14. So now we can go purity four. Uh, at 20 hearts and a book. Level 13. However many hearts it wants, I think it's 25. As bloody as it gets, a level 14 vampire. I did not get more health for that. I guess that was wrong. The highest vampire level. Now I can uh, level up my skills. I can get blood vision, which is seeing stuff through walls. Very useful. And then I can get attack damage boost. So now I permanently just deal more damage. That's amazing. Okay. All right. I'm going to charge up my sword now because what we have to do next is, uh, yeah, we're going to need some damage. That is an enchantment table, not the charge thing. There we go. Charge it up. Now I'm going to wait until tomorrow night because I don't want it to happen in, you know, in the middle of the night. And then we're going to go take that village by force. The village over there, it's controlled by hunters. I'm going to head over there and I'm going to take it over and it's going to become my very own vampire village under my rule. All right. Night 74. All right. It is now night 74, the night of the raid. I'm heading over there. Village is just over here. I know exactly where the totem is. It's like right over there somewhere. Here it is, the hunter village. A nearby hunter village's attack from vampires. Oh, you want to fight back, huh? Nah, buddy. I just got a pitchfork. Yo, I got a pitchfork. The villagers are fighting back. Where's my vampire friends? The, the, the hunters are winning. Here's my friends. What's good? I'll help you out, buddy. Boom, got him. I'll get this guy. Uh, rage mode. Everyone dies. How are the hunters winning? Village almost captured 11 defenders left. Yo, every vampire besides me sucks. I'm the best. See entities through walls in the dark. Toggle with key. Switch vision. Okay. All right. There's horses. Dude, blood vision is sick. Look at this. Do I have to kill the villagers? So that, no, you don't kill the villagers. I don't understand then. It's 50-50. I might be the final vampire. There's the final hunter. I found him. Thank you, blood vision. And there we go this village is officially run by the vampires aka me also most of them got killed by zombies most of the villagers are zombies now i could fix that i guess boom cure them need as many residents as we can get well now that i am the ruler of this village i think it's appropriate to ascend past vampire level 14. only issue for that is i need the villager or the 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 Faction representative, the vampire representative to spawn, and he has not spawned yet. All right, I'm going to go ahead and clear out this little tower right here, because this is going to be my new home. To break every spawner, it's all that matters. All right, this is going to be my tower. Oh, dude, look at look at the, the, the weird dirt. Is that because it's a vampire village? That's so cool. All right, this is my representative. Are you worthy? I get five purity, five blood. 32 gold ingots, infect 25 mobs, and win three faction raids, and I become a vampire lord. So, uh, yeah, I am going to accept that quest, and that is our next goal. We want to become vampire lord. So I need five purity, five blood. I need to do three raids. I need to infect mobs with sanguinaire. Okay, I guess I can go ahead and infect some mobs right now. Like... Boom, that, that, that's one. Also, I don't think I really showed this in the video yet, but check this out, right? I infected this pig. Now wait for it. Look at him. That's a vampire pig now. He's a vampire. Uh, so, uh, yeah, I'm going to infect some mobs around the village first. See if we can get them to, to uh, 25 mobs infected. Uh, Can I do the horses? Oh, I can. All right, we're going to get some vampire horse. Can I ride a vampire horse? All right, there we go. We have a vampire horse and I actually can ride it. That's so cool. I should have done this, dude. All right, I'm going to spend the rest of this night Okay, the entirety of this night, infecting every mob that I can see, trying to finish that off. So, I'm gonna do that now. There we go. 
All right, I just need two more mobs. And there's one. And there's my final mob, one of these pigs. Okay. Now I need either to do three raids, get five blood or 32 gold. Gold is pretty easy because I don't need my leveling altar anymore. I'm now going to go look for some villages to, uh, to do some raids on. Hello, village. Where is your totem? Uh, they have this guy. Don't come after me, man. There's loot in your chest. Book! Book is good. Book is very good. Okay. So now that we have that book, I can grab this obsidian, this diamond, right? And then I can make a village totem top. So then I can place this down, this, and I can raid the village. All right. And I did use one of my books. I have one more for emergencies. So I'm going to hunt around a little bit more. Maybe I can find something. All right. The village has been captured. Did that count? Yes, that does count. Awesome. Awesome. Okay. So I need to find one more village with a totem or one more vampire book and we're done. Okay. Jungle temple. Right. That's the gimmick here. Right. Yeah. No, no, no. I get it. Trust me. I, I understand. Yeah, yeah. Yeah. Oh my gosh. Can this stop happening? This is the worst one. It just keeps happening. Yo, I'm glad I have so much life steal. What is this dude? There's so many. This is worth it. Look how much XP I have. Oh my gosh, I'm getting so much. Not that book. Come on, you know you know this. Okay, whatever. Well, that was certainly a temple. Back on the village slash obsidian hunt. Oh, there's lava. Yes, dude. Okay. All right, I just need a couple obsidian. There we go. Do it while in rage. Look at haste. Dude, take over a village. It is six obsidian. There we go. If I need more later, I'll deal with it then. I see pathway. That's a village. Yeah. Uh, is it vampire? Oh, I'm sorry. It's a hunter village. They have garlic blood, which means I can activate a raid here. Now I just kill these guys. Hello, hunter representative. Rage mode. Vampire book. Yo, that's so good. Yo, I don't know how we got a vampire book. I think the advanced vampire that was with me died. Captured by vampires. That is another raid done on our quest to become vampire lord. We need one more. Yeah, I'm gonna head home. I'm gonna head home now. So I can just take over another village with my uh, totem now. Uh, okay, 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 okay. This is a, a risk that I shouldn't do, but this is a baby tower. I think I can take it. Maybe if I just go in from the top and ignore the guys down there. I'm just gonna do that. I'm gonna go in from the top. I just want the diamonds. So I'm just gonna like spam project out this guy. Ow. All right, got him, got him, got him. Okay. We killed that king. Let's block this off. I can't take a full tower yet, but I can cheese the king. Um, I need diamond blocks. I will take this. All right, there we go. That's what we needed to see. All right, I just needed some more diamonds so I could actually like, you know, do some stuff. Okay, now I just head back home. Okay, there's a village, but is there... Oh, there's a hunter. Hello. I think I'm just going to go ahead and take over this village. It's neutral, so it'll be really fast. Boom. Under attack by vampires, this should be our final village of the, uh, of the, 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 the path to vampire lord. Sweet. All right, there we go. A village has been captured by vampires, and now I have done all the raids, all the infections, and I have all the golden ingots, so I just need five more pure blood. Okay, conveniently, the, the vampire forest was between me and home, and there was a village here, which is kind of cool. Anyways, I'm here in the vampire forest. I'm now going to kill five level five vampire barons, if I can find any. Okay. Epic Baron hunting montage, go! All right, that's our fourth blood. So we managed to get four blood just from that one night. And I have a plan for how I want to get the fifth because we, we, we have a certain individual who has supported us in this entire journey. And I want to I want to support him financially, if you know what I'm saying. Hello, my dude. All right, so we, if we just trade him like this, that should immediately level him up. And then he sells a purity five blood. There we go. That is our final one. And if we go into our quests, I have completed Are You Worthy? I am worthy of becoming a vampire lord. And I have to head home so I can talk to my guy to get the, the thing. And yeah, yeah, I'm going to head home now. Finally. Hello, your lord is here. Where is my representative? There he is. Hello, sir. I am worthy. It says bar at the bottom of my screen. The next step. Are you kidding me? Lord level two. Okay, I need five more purity, five blood and 48. So are you just kind of like getting me to get you money or something? Did I get like a skill point for that? No. Wait, right here. Oh, oh, okay. There's a new skill tree for becoming a vampire lord. Okay. All right. I think we're going to go for Lord level two and then probably that'll be as high as we need to go. But first of all, I just became a vampire Lord. So I think I should get some uh, some out 
outfit, some attire fitting of a vampire lord. I do want to enchant a pickaxe. I do have the diamonds for it as well. So let's go ahead and do that real quick before I do anything else. Silk touch. Silk touch. There we go. Oh, and it got the efficiency already and soulbound, which doesn't matter because I would never die in a... I would never die in a hundred days. <laughs> what? No. Boom. Efficiency five as well. Might as well. And boom. There we go. Really good pickaxe. Nice. All right. We do this, we do this, it's like this, 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 and purity one. Vampire cloak. All right, so now I do this, we get some pants, and then we just need this. Oh. And then we have our epic vampire lord outfit. Where's the cloak? I can't even see it past my other cape. Can I turn that off? Haha, -ha, my vampire cloak. It actually just looks worse than my other cape, though. So I'm just going to, like, leave that on. There we go. I have my crown, my vampire lord crown. Let's go, dude. Yeah, I'm going to enchant it with like, level one. I don't think the protection does very much, though. All right. There. Now it's shiny. Except for my boots, which are which are a, a bobble that I can't enchant. All right. Now I want to become level two. I think level two would be very cool. So I'm going to head over and get the, uh, the, the blood that I need. Any level fives? Of course you're next to the hide behind. Why wouldn't you be? Lifesteal blade. Suck sword or whatever it's called. Suck blade. Combo. Combo. Let's go. That looks like level five. All right. Yeah, I can fight in the water. Was good. Another level five. I'm glad he's like the most common. Uh-huh. Projectile. All right. Number three. Level five. There we go. Wombo combo. Let's go. You're getting clapped. Let's go. Fourth blood already. I saw another Baron. Is it level five? Yes, it is. All right. We have our fifth one, but I might as well kill that guy. All right. You just happen to be here. Oh, you're invisible again. Hide behind. Dude, I take so much damage. Good thing I have life. If I did not have life steal, I would have died so many times. Another level five. I I'm going to have to. All right, there we go. A seventh blood. Might as well. I mean, oh, I need to kill hunters, too. I can't go home yet. Right. Okay, we're going to look for some hunters, then. We're going to hunt the hunters. Hi, you spawned in a tree. Hi, you spawned in the dirt. All right. Dude, my armor's getting damaged. I'm going to... It's going to break my crown. All right, we need 23 more hunters. I'm just going to go do all the hunters right now. It'll probably be a cool little montage for the video. Okay, random, but I'm going to take over this village real quick. Just, just trust me, okay? This totem doesn't work. Search for another one. Oh, that's because the village already has a totem. I'm stupid. Okay, I'm going to hit this totem then. All right, where's the representative? You should spawn over there. Found him. Dang it. Your, 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 your stuff sucks. Kill 14 skeletons. Sure, let me do that. 14 skeletons. One, two, three, Six, seven, and finally number 14. All right, I'm gonna go back to this village and claim that quest and also kill my hunters. That's two quests in one. I finished your quest. You get a new quest or do you just give me random leggings? I, I think you did give me a new quest to kill 10 scouts. I don't really, bro, I, I'm gonna be real. I don't want that. Goodbye. All right, this village can die. I don't care. I'm going home now. No, my crown broke. What? That bat broke my crown. You suck. There he is. Hello, sir. I've completed your request. There we go. I'm Lord level two. Vis. Oh, oh, like, like, uh, Viscount. That's what it means. It was, it was bar. That was a baron. One more. I'm not doing, no. He's trying to get more money out of me. Screw you. But with this lore level, I can level up these skills to get minions. But I can't get minions without a specific item that you get from a quest. And quests are entirely RNG, so that's great. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to get a minion by the end of the 100 days. If not, I might uh, use some uh, creative methods to get it. Just, 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 just to make a cool ending. I might use some creative ending, you know, creative. We'll see, I don't know. Because, uh, see, I, I need I need this, right? This. I need, a, I need a minion binding item. As a task reward from a vampire representative, prerequisite lord level one. I'm lord level two, so I know that I can get that. Hunter hunt. I, I can do that. Hunter hunting. Okay, I'll, I'll kill ten hunters. Sure. I'll try again. Ten hunters. I can do that. Yo, did it not take my gold or pure blood for that quest? Am I stupid? I'm level two but it didn't consume the gold or the pure blood. Why? All right, that quest is done. I don't know why. It, why did it not consume the blood? Now I'm mad and confused. Mr. Representative, I did your quest. Break some bones. I hate you. This guy sucks, dude. Okay, I'm going to take this skill point that I have. I'm not going to use it on this tree because I don't care about this tree anymore. I want to level up this. 
Better minions. So I can't get minions because he won't give me minions. Give me minions. Okay, I think I might have to wait a day. I, I increased the amount of tasks that this guy can have total. So I think that might make it so I'm able to get the, the one that I need. Anyways, I have another plan that I want to do before the end of this 100 days and 100 nights. And guess what? I have no time to do it. What I want to do is I want to convert this tower into my own epic vampire lord tower. It would be very epic and cool to do that. Uh, I need a lot of stone bricks. So basically, I want to replace all the bricks and all the floors. I'm going to replace the floors with wood, the bricks with the with uh, with vampire bricks, right? And I also want to get rid of all of these. These are annoying. So I'm going to do that. Um, I'm going to do that. I'm going to replace the staircases. I'm going to replace the bricks. I'm going to do all that. And to do that, I need to go mine a ton of uh, of stone with my silk touch pick, which is why I wanted it in the first place. Yeah, I wanted this pick for that reason. So I'm going to go mine a ton of stone real quick. All right, I have all my stone, at least all that I can get right now, or all, all that I can convert with the stuff that I have. Now I need to use the old suck blade, my retired one, because it has looting on it, to get uh, ink sacks from squids. So I'm going to do that now. Oh, a blood moon. That is going to make this so much worse in every way. Hello, sir. No, you only have four quests still. Thanks. Yeah, so it's just straight up squids aren't spawning because of the blood moon. That is like the worst timing possible. Well, I guess I'll farm squids tomorrow night. That's uh, that that happened. <laughs> okay, hopefully squids will spawn tonight. There we go. That's what we like to see. This guy's the worst. Go anywhere else, man. Literally, no one likes you. Come here. Did you want to fight so bad? Come on. Oh, look at that, idiot. Anyway, we're at 27 ink sacks now. Plus, I have this beak, so it's another six. Hey, stop eating those squids. They're mine. Haha, stole your food. Stupid piranhas. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. I got five squid beaks. I didn't even see that, dude. Okay. All right. So I'm going to convert all this to stone bricks. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So then we make this vampire stone brick, and then we can make dark stone brick. There we... I just... Made so many stairs on accident. Well, anyways, I'm going to do a montage, a replay mod montage of me doing that tower. Now I'm going to do this tower. I'm going to rebuild the whole thing in my own cool blocks that I yes, we're going to do this now. Hey, this is uh, me from the future talking. So my replay mod is just completely broken. It crashes whenever I try to render a file. So uh, there's not actually a replay mod thing for the tower and I didn't record it so there's no first person thing either. So uh yeah, just know that I built the tower over a couple of days. Yeah. And my tower is complete. I would say this is a tower befitting of a vampire lord that owns this town personally. I may not have been able to make the civilization that I wanted, a full-on vampire. I mean, it kind of is. Like, I mean, you know, it's kind of corrupting over time. It's going to look really cool. One day we have our vampire city, you know, it, it's kind of a civilization, but not not quite. <gasps> oh, oh, I can get a minion. Yes, yes, yes. Okay, okay. I was so worried that I wouldn't find that. That, that okay, that, that threw me off. Anyways, yes, this is my tower. Um, is there anything in it? We don't talk about that, okay? There, there's no, no there, there's not. All right, there's nothing in this tower because I don't have time to put stuff in it. It is day 97 right now or night 97. I keep doing that and I am scared and out of time, but it's a pretty cool tower. All right, I need 32 gold. Easy. I I still have that because I never took it from my other quest that I did for some reason. It's it's right here. Then four advanced hunters and five vampire barons. That's really really easy. Let's find four advanced hunters. You're advanced, right? Yes, you are. He broke my coat. I'm gonna have to remake all my armor before we uh we end this off. I have something pretty cool planned for the finale. All right, there's the vampire forest. We need to find five barons, which should be very, very easy. There's one, level four. All right, one down. There's another one, level five. Oh, that's two barons. Of course, level five, which sucks, but whatever. There we go. All right, and fight. Not my pants. Yeah, four barons down out of the five. Let's go. My final baron, die. All right, there we go. Final baron done. I just need to get three more advanced hunters. Hello, number two. All right, advanced hunter. Hello, you're number three. And that guy spawned in grass. Nice. I'm just gonna fly around and look for one. We need one more advanced hunter. We get our minion. And we can go fight the final boss and call it a day. Bro, why am I not getting my spawns? Yes, an advanced hunter. 
Hello, hi. You are my final one. You will get me my first and only minion. There we go. Okay, cool, 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 okay. Hello, representative, hello, hello, hello. Remember that quest you gave me? I finished it. Give me my th my thing, thank you. Okay, my first, my, my only vampire minion binding. All right, it's still 999. Let's go find our minion to, 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 to bind with my scroll. I'm gonna go bind a minion right now. And there's our guy, hello. Looks like you have like resistance or something too. Perfect, perfect. I dub you. My minion can be bound. Oh, you got a tiny. Oh, I can give him gear. Oh, I can give him stats. Ooh, I ain't doing this because I don't have time. I can change what he looks like. Blood sucker 69. Oh, I can give him my skin. I'm not doing that because that's weird. That's my skin. All right, blood sucker 69. I need to get this guy some some armor. All right, I'm gonna head back to my tower and we're gonna we're gonna make some uh we're gonna make him a nice hat. We're gonna make him a nice hat. I don't think he can wear armor because he's a vampire, but I'll try it. Can I give him suck blade? Yes, there we go. All right, suck blade has found its new owner. Um, and I assume you can wear armor because why not? So I'll make you some, I'll make you uh, some armor with this iron block that I have. There we go. Okay, that's our minion. Now let me just remake my crown real quick. Okay, it's it's night 100, we gotta go fast. Okay, okay, okay. Give me that chest piece. Pop that there, pop this in here. Boom, level 30, unbreaking protection four. Perfect, we'd love to see that. The chest piece will give level 30, prod three. Then we'll just do level whatever on these ones. Uh, magic protection might be useful. Soul bound really doesn't matter for you. All right, there we go. Give him his armor. Yeah. Has a sword okay 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 now i have somewhere to go i have a final boss that bloodsucker 69 and i are going to take down together okay oh there it is okay there is our final objective that is our final boss okay oh boy here we go i actually know nothing about this this is supposedly like the god of the pillagers. So, uh, so that uh, predicament we had before in the Illager Tower, this is going to be revenge for that. Let's make our way up with Bloodsucker69. Yep, there's definitely Illagers here. What's good? Y'all want to fight? What is up with y'all? All right, I need to get Bloodsucker on defend me. We ascend. Evokers. Oh gosh, okay. Wow, I got knocked down fast. How do the Vindicators not have their axes? Ow. I do no damage in the water, dude. I, I literally can't fight in the water. I would like Bloodsucker to come up here with me. It doesn't seem to be happening. Be gone. Dude, I hate Vexes. What is this? What is that? It's a totem golem. Okay, I don't know how I'm intended to do this, but I'm not doing it that way. Look, I made it to the top. Oh, there's invisible. Oh, they never remember good. Nope, there's invisible blocks. How do I get in here? What if I did it with creative mode? Would that be acceptable? Because I want to fight this thing and I can't get in there. Hold on, I'm cheating. Oh, it didn't like that. <laughs> Bro, it crashed. Okay, I'm back in. I want to check real quick. Is there another way I'm meant to be able to do this? The emerald key. Oh, okay. So hear me out. So hear me out. What I'll do is I'll just toss out a totem of undying, right? Boom, gone. And I'll just give myself the emerald key. Yeah, the emerald. I'll just I'll just do that. Challenge to the gods. That's me. So anyways, I, I just got this the emerald key somehow. Whoa, guys. What happened? Where did this come from? Oh, that's actually really sick. But how are you meant to? Oh, dude, that's so cool. Hold on. But then you go like this. Boom. Boom. And then you're up. Dude, that's so sick. Oh, I see. And then you emerald key up. I'm going to clear all of these guys real quick. There's so many evokers. Chill. Dude, there's vexes everywhere. All right. It's me and the final boss, which is that thing right there. And I do not know how it works. Okay, we got to go fast. The moon is going down and, it, and things are. Yeah. Okay. Do I just break it? Oh, that's the boss. Okay. All right. It's falling and exploding right now. There's now multiple. It's making funny noises. This thing is really strong. It spawns vexes. Awesome. I hate vexes. All right. Rage mode. My blade is charged. It just has that much health. This thing's insane, dude. All right. It's almost half HP. It's spawning these clones. I hate that. It's half. It's, it's below half. Wait, what? It destroyed its own drop with lightning. Am I crazy or did it die at like 25% HP? Oh, no wait! It gave me this. The conch of conjuring. Oh, I have cool powers now. Well, I defeated the god. Oh, I defeated the god of pillagers. I, do I didn't expect it to, to die when it did. That was a little weird. But hey, me and my boy Bloodsucker69, who did so much during that fight, as you can see, he was definitely doing his part. We, uh, we certainly 
We, we, we took it out. We took it out. We defeated it. Now, that's 100 days as a vampire lord now. Vampire lord. I just want to test something real quick, by the way. Out of curiosity, what happens if I'm in the sun? I haven't really experienced this yet. I just want to know, you know? Oh, yeah, that would make sense. Anyways, thank you all for watching. This has been 100 Days as a Vampire. I'm now a Vampire Lord. I made it all the way. I have my civilization. We have blood, Bloodsucker69. I defeated the God of Pillagers. Goodbye.